Good Thursday morning to you. Can you feel it? Can you feel the weekend just around the corner? I know you can. So a uh, little bit of advice. Don't be that person on Friday afternoon who is absolutely frantic thinking, I didn't get this done. I didn't get that done. I'm going to have to work, work on the weekend. Ah! Okay, don't do that to yourself. Life is too short. Get those, the most important things done today, if you possibly can, and then the rest of it will fall, fall, fall into place tomorrow. Okay? Um, and you're going to have a nice weekend. More about that tomorrow. Today, we are, oh, who am I? I am Kitty Andrews with DeclutterTheBrain.com, uh, helping people to thrive in, uh, in a calm and productive environment. Uh, who are those people? Those are people with uh, who are uh, overwhelmed by their accumulations. So I provide personalized decluttering solutions to them and they can thrive for life. You want to hear more? All right, you just hold that thought and we will give you your next one. How many, Jessica? One step to take in about f four minutes from now. Now, uh, travel is disruptive at best. So first you want to just really determine the purpose and the length of the trip and the feeling that you desire. If you want to be businesslike, if you want to be more casual and neat, what's, uh, this is not a waste of time because it will help you to choose your clothes, it will help you to choose your flight length, uh, your highway routes, your hotels, all of these kind of things that will help you to do that. And of course, it will help you to choose your clothes and all of the things that you're going to take with you. So determine the purpose and length of your trip and the feeling that you want to have. Uh, speaking of what you're going to pack, lighten up, try to put everything in a carry-on if you possibly can. That's the only way that I travel. Um, and you can get small little containers like this at Michael's, especially ladies. Uh, these are screw, screw tops and you can get them at Michael's and they're plastic and you don't, uh, many times you know that uh, 50 milliliter of mouthwash, you don't need all that mouthwash. A little thing like this will last you for a week. I'm not kidding you. Now also uh, little plastic bags like this available at your, at your dollar store in various sizes can carry uh, your face wipes, uh, a handful of deodorant, whatever it is, okay? Just use your imagination. It's a lot of fun. It saves a lot of space. Um, uh, da, 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 right, okay. And when it comes to your clothes, just lay everything out on the bed that you think you want to take and then subtract half. Hmm? Yes, you don't. I know. You need six pairs of, of high heels. No, you don't. And Michael, if you need six pairs of high heels, we've got to chat, okay? All right, yesterday we talked about the stores are closed. Please uh, do not get stuck in an airport at 11.30 at night with no food because the stores are closed and worse yet, the bar is closed. Uh, make sure that you have certainly some sort of protein meals like peanuts Peanuts is good, and I carry I carry a big bag of peanuts. Something that you can um, click click the little top. These are in fact vine leaves, uh, and they are absolutely wonderful. You can carry a can of corned beef with you. Yes, it has some weight to it, but I'll tell you what: if you're hungry and your blood sugar is sinking, what's your health worth? Hmm? Yes. All right. Um, all right. Uh, Today, I want to go home, or do I? Okay, think about before you're leaving, what do you want to come home to? You want to come home to a clean place, a tidy place, two or three days of meals in the freezer. Make sure that you're set up for when you come home so that you can come, you're going to be tired. You know this, you're going to be bagged for the first 24 hours at least. So just make sure that everything is nice to come home to and that you're looked after. And that's even if you do have a, um, people at home. If you're single, this is really, really important to make sure that everything is lovely when you come home. So you don't have to work on anything. All right, uh, tomorrow it takes practice. Until then, download your seven easy steps to conquer your physical and mental clutter. And while you're there, go ahead and book that quick and no-cost call with me and let's declutter your traveling, your space, your brain, your health, your heart, your habits, 
anything you need decluttered for life. Have a great day, everybody. Bye for now.